What's up everyone? This is the Jose Show. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. You guys are the best. So now we got a lot of interesting stuff to talk about on today's show. So now let's get started. Now let's start off with Ellen DeGeneres who revealed not so long ago that she was abused sexually by her stepfather when she was a teenager. Ellen DeGeneres revisits abuse she experienced as a teenager in an upcoming episode of David Letterman's Netflix show, My Next Guest Needs No Introduction. In the interview, which releases Friday, DeGeneres talks about being sexually assaulted by her mother's then-husband when she was a teen. The abuse started, DeGeneres said, after her mother Betty was diagnosed with breast cancer. He told me when my mom was out of town that he'd felt a lump in her breast and needed to feel my breasts, she recalled in her conversation with Letterman. Anyway, he convinced me that he needs to feel my breasts and then he tries to do it again another time, and then another time. DeGeneres first opened up about the abuse by her stepfather who was deceased in a 2005 interview with Allure. She told Letterman she's sharing her account with the hope of empowering other women and girls. In quote, I'm angry at myself because, you know, I didn't, I was too weak to stand up to. I was 15 or 16, DeGeneres said. It's a really horrible, horrible story and the only reason I'm actually going to go into detail about it is because I want other girls to not ever let someone do that. DeGeneres said she didn't tell her mom right away in an effort to protect her. And quote, I should never have protected my mother. I should have protected myself and I didn't tell her for a few years and then I told her, she said, and then she didn't believe me. And then she stayed with him for 18 more years and finally left him because he changed the story so many times. End quote. DeGeneres also said she wants to encourage other survivors not to suffer in silence. End quote. When I see people speaking out, especially now, it angers me when victims aren't believed. DeGeneres said, adding, because we just don't make stuff up. Okay, so you guys... This is a pretty rough story, and I was pretty shocked, and I was pretty sad after hearing that Ellen DeGeneres suffered such thing when she was a teenager. And, you know, what's very sad of it all is that her own stepfather was the one that did this to her. See, unfortunately... It's situations like these that not even are... Uh, it's situations like these that that are so horrible to the point that you can't even trust your own family. That even your own family could be the one um, abusing you or could be the one taking advantage of you. It's very sad. So... Um, honestly, yes, I agree with Ellen DeGeneres. Ellen DeGeneres should have stood up for herself when she was 15 or 16. And even though she didn't have the knowledge to do it back in the day. but And, and that she should have protected herself and not her mother. But, I mean, if I were Ellen DeGeneres, I would have gotten my stuff and I would have left and I would have ran away from home and I would have left a brief note to my mother saying, you know what, I love you mama, 